Hi! <laughs> this is day 13, epic day 13 <laughs> of the Hope Tour. Um, we're driving out of Fred Hutchinson uh, Cancer Research Center right now, and I just met with um, Dr. Sanders, oh, amazing lady. She's actually retiring today, and uh, she took time um, to um, talk to me and meet with me. She is so sweet, and I literally could have sat there and listened to her all day. Mm -hmm. She talked about a lot of her research um, that she's done, and I seriously just got so into it. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. She, she was really wow. amazing. So, so sweet and kind mm -hmm. and just brilliant. Brilliant. Brilliant woman. Brilliant. And then... Um, <laughs> This is going to be a two-part video because I'm just like pretty much freaking out <laughs> and I had to like capture this on video, but um, then I met with Dr. Lee Hartwell, he's a Nobel laureate, I'm seriously going to like cry right now, and seriously just like being in the same room with him, I was just like so inspired and oh, now I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> he is seriously an amazing, sweet, just brilliant. He's like, <laughs> has that same level of like philosophical thought as I do. And seriously, oh my gosh, it was like the most amazing like conversation I've ever had with anyone in my whole entire life. <laughs> and he's just the sweetest man. He just got back from three weeks in Europe and uh, got up and <laughs> came down and met us, which was so nice for so him nice to take to take that time. But he seriously, oh my gosh, he is such an incredible man and I just felt so honored and just privileged to be sitting there talking to him. <laughs> I can't even put it any other way. No. I don't even know what no, else to no say. No, there are no words. Yeah, he is just... Oh my gosh, yeah. yeah. And then he's all, keep in touch. And I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah. And uh, he had, what he said about my book. Yeah, he had... Yeah. And uh, he, he just kept on it saying it, like what it, my book meant to him and what he got out of it. And for such a brilliant, like <laughs> incredible, incredible man to get something out of my book, even read my book. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was just like, had to not cry like <laughs> while I was meeting him. Oh my gosh. So I just had to capture that <laughs> for you and the... Because um, we can hardly breathe. Yeah, right the now. excitement. The excitement. Afterwards. And um, this will probably be another two-part video because I'll probably update you a little later about... Um, we're on our way to Seattle Children's right now. And, ooh, it's 11.38. I thought I was getting hungry. <laughs> and um, I'm going to be presenting to the residents and then meeting with patients afterwards. And so I'm really excited about that. Panera... Um, where um, I had my uh, wish presentation party at Panera um, in Santa Maria, back where I live. <laughs> and um, uh, Panera is so generously, co they contacted us and we hooked them up with Make-A-Wish and they're like catering the whole thing. So there's going to be like yummy Panera. They've been um, amazing. Very supportive. Very supportive and generous and wonderful. So um, they're catering kind of on my presentation, which is like at lunchtime for the residents. And uh, that's next. And then meeting with some patients that are up for visits today. And wow, after my talk with Dr. Hartwell, I am <laughs> incredibly inspired and just, I'm ready to become a doctor like now. <laughs> like now. I'm ready to find a cure for cancer like now. <laughs> it's going to happen. Yeah. All right. Um, I'll check back in later. And uh, I love you guys. Love you. And, um, yeah, I'll update you on all the wonderful things happening today a little later. All right. Mm -hmm. Bye.